This old lady and supermarket worker have gotten into the habit of having a standoff every time they see each other. They look so dumb, but I love them. I bet you didn't know that you needed a video of an armadillo catching a wall right now, did you? Studies show that watching a beaver eat cabbage lowers stress by 17% thinking about him. Are those parrots? Canadian photographer captures polar bears frolicking in a field of fireweed. A panda sitting in a pool, twiddling its legs. Baby giraffe loves to smile. Sometimes you just have to take a pause and enjoy a photogenic baby sloth. He's very suspicious of people stealing his tail. Dog thinks the bone is real. Get him a real bone or I'm calling the police. This man just pulled an Uno reverse card on the bear. He's inflating him. Stop it. This cat has the most beautiful eyes. I actually thought she was a photorealism painting. The most majestic poop of all time. I accidentally left my back door open and came home to this. I don't know if I should run and call the police or just let him chill. My dog was declared cancer free today, so I'm reverse searing a steak. That horse isn't even galloping, it's running like a human. A sloth playing with water. Sloths are both cute and creepy in equal measures. Today I picked up a new hobby, drawing stick figure arms on birds. Scientists recently discovered that rats love driving tiny cars, even when they don't get treats. When put in mazes adapted to tiny cars, the rats just enjoyed cruising around. This is Lenny and he absolutely loves sliding down hills, blessing your eyes with arctic weasels, because honestly, just look at them. Baby chinchilla. For the love of God, someone hug him. To brighten up your day, here's a baby platypus. If bears are scary predators, how do you explain this? As if something with ears that adorable could possibly be deadly. He broke a plate and he's scared of the punishment. No, I broke it. Let him go. Today I learned about the Arabian sand boa. It looks like a child's best effort at drawing a snake. Should I take my dog to the vet? I would. Can we normalize guys complimenting other guys? Hey, you're killing it my guy. Superb idea fellow dude. Nice homie. Man gets cancer on cancerous growth, killing the growth and ending his cancer. This dog has her own special way of getting out of the pool. He showed her how to pet him. My heart. A cockatoo socializing with veterinarian staff. Look at this dude. Having the time of his life. Adorable is what it is. Kissing your pet and seeing their reaction. They use the same pink dye that they use on banknotes. This makes ivory unsellable and it can't be consumed. The animals are not harmed and it is saving their lives. Three kangaroos are a lot like regular kangaroos except they're twice as fluffy and almost resemble small tree-dwelling bears. God dropping new animals with no release date whatsoever, just like that. Lately, the only emotion I've ever had is lazy frog. When you live in a bad neighborhood, but you know everyone, that is the goat friend. This still cracks me up. Like, can you imagine you're 130 years old and suddenly a gigantic alien baby starts following you around? What do you mean? I can't hold the water. My mom made a two-person mittens so my dad and her can hold hands on walks. The best face swap ever. I don't need to see this. Ah, oh, the big gator missed the food and got embarrassed. Poor guy. The lion looks like he forgot where he parked his car. Look at this beautiful boy. This looks like a traffic cone strapped to a swan. Ever noticed how uncanny animal camouflage is? These animals disappear into their environments like a ninja. Ella, stay back a little bit. No, he wants to cuddle. And this whole dinosaur bird, just let her do it. Sometimes I forget that there are wild hamsters. Like, now this is what I'm talking about. I don't know whether term scaredy cat came from. His cat's really acting like God left them in charge. To beat some foxes. Looks like someone tried to draw a normal fox and couldn't get the face right. What I see versus what the cat sees before I pet it. They associate this stance with love. Please look at this picture of my friend's cat who had to get shaved for surgery. Gave Peanut a bath and after drying him, he stuck out his hand for me to hold. UPS has a page where the drivers can post about all the dogs they meet on the job. Thank me later. Just washed my cow. Tell her she's cute. Just a chubby penguin. He has his own figure. I'm crying. My teacher's son is off for spring break and she brought him to class in his Godzilla costume. Went to the zoo today and I'm 99% sure that's not a cheetah. Undeniable evidence that Snoopy is really a beagle. A deer wandered into my front yard. It stopped to watch my neighbor's little dog. My cat stopped to watch the deer. I stopped to watch my cat and I stopped to read this post. Food isn't allowed in the living room. His tablet isn't allowed in the kitchen. He beat the system. I quit. Family back to school picture. If I don't hold the sign too, I am going to scream. Okay, this one takes it home this year. My cat is afraid of baths, so in order to get him into one, I have to fill it with rubber ducks. Oh boy, this is not the floor. This mama cat sent her kitten to the hospital to get help. He's undercover. Let me know if you can find him. My goal was to graduate before I reached 100 years of age. I made it with 33 years to spare. Name a better dad. I'll wait. Dog fakes a broken leg to get pets and treats from tourists.
I support the hustle. My dog had a cast put on his paw and is simply defeated. Got my first job on the 10th day of my release from prison. Starting from the bottom up, progress is the best feeling in the world. I love posts like this. It shows realistic and relatable growth, which often isn't shown on social media. Baby capybaras taking shelter under a capybara statue. I bought my hamster a little hamster bed and we do everything together. Disney has people thinking that wild animals are friendly. Most important thing you'll see today, it was when he picked up his back leg that did it for me. Dog and lion bond. Dogs are- I don't even know why they're doing this. Sweet dreams, my pink friend. This is the only picture I want to look at for the rest of my life. One of my friends got chased by little pig during his bike ride. This is the opposite of a problem. I bought a mini toy laptop for my dog so he can at least look like he's helping support this family. When you thought for sure you were about to get eaten, but it's just a human wanting to take a selfie with you. May I offer you a tiny frog in these, t in these troubled times. In case you haven't seen one before. Here is a baby bison. Today, I learned that this exists. It's that thing. I feel you, buddy. I don't know what this is, but I relate. If you feed a moose, it may become aggressive and attack the next human it meets if it has no food to offer. Feeding a moose is my favorite hobby now. Yeah, this is, um, this is what you call sand art, and, uh, it's pretty impressive, but I don't plan on reading all of that, so you can if you want. Haven't been able to stop thinking about this picture. The warmth, the scrunched face, is. I'm so happy for her. I frolicked for the first time ever today, bro. Y'all ever frolic before? Why did no one tell me about this? I was taking a nice picture of a llama, and then, photo of mice sprawling on a subway platform, wins wildlife photography award. You can't even understand how many years I have waited for a picture like this. You really can't understand. Kiwis are always relevant. Got the feeling my gecko doesn't like me. Me too. Typical. You spend an hour stacking toads, and not one of the miserable sods will smile for the camera. Honestly, I don't know why I bother. A mouse that went into mission impossible mode in my house. The best part is these frogs would be too little for the tiger to see them as food, but anything big enough to eat the food would probably catch its attention. Smart little frogs ride big kitty boat. Taxi cat. Want to know what a cow looks like washed and blow dried? This is what a cow looks washed and blow dried. Look at this. Look at this happy fox. Throw back to last year when I made a snowman and it started to melt but refroze overnight. I work in an animation studio with some of the best artists I've ever met and this is the pumpkin that won our carving contest yesterday. Would you slap him for 88 million dollars. No, no, absolutely not. The only thing I'm slapping on him is a little kiss. I would. I'm not sure what kind of luck the $115 frozen pizza badger is supposed to bring, but I'm not taking any chances. Oh my gosh, I have two hands and three foods. Oh, poor little dude. I have never seen an animal look more distressed. Dog paws look like tiny koalas. Behold, a 120 year old rhododehedron. They rarely grow into anything larger than a shrub, yet alone a tree. Why doesn't this have more likes? Because because we're scared. Dirk has 300 million dollars and his wife still sends him to games with a plate of leftovers wrapped in tin foil. My boyfriend and I got really competitive making gingerbread houses, picking up the pieces and moving on. How do cats even work? Don't question it. Moist boys. I've never seen wet lion manes. I never imagined this. This is too much. I have so many fields. I love them all. The unholy trinity of creatures that look like each other, but aren't even related. I sold a rug to someone on Marketplace and they just sent me this picture with the message. Little man is chuffed. It's a baby dragon. No, don't eat your tail. Baby donkeys are so underrated. Cats of the apocalypse. For the record, these are amazing. Death is most peaceful. I find it sobering. Dog finds the fluffiest dogs in daycare, so she can nap on them. Woman shocked. A Singapore community cat looks dead, but it was just very calm as kids decorated it. Boba tea. I think you guys need to see this table that's for sale near me. This thing looks like it jumped out of a Disney movie. Pomeranian. Japanese spits and Samoid are just evolutionary stages of the same Pokemon. This one on the bottom right is trying really hard to be a good cupcake. Spot the cupcake. Mice and jumpers. Stew a little. Today I learned that conservationists recycle Wimbledon tennis balls as predator-proof shelters for them. This kitten smiling bigger than the little girl for a photo. 1955. My mom had a little lemon tree in her backyard for a year and this is her first lemon. Thankful to this unknown man for striking a pose and for not messing with my camera setup after he he stumbled upon it. Also added a bobcat using the log just a couple weeks prior. Accidentally washed a piece of Halloween confetti down the sink and I'm afraid to say the plug hole is now very haunted. 90 year old tortoise fitted with wheels after rat attack can now go twice as fast. I don't know what that says. Homeboy did not have to flex that hard in the third picture. I airdropped this to my mom. I'm alone. Nobody care. I care you. Oh, that poor baby monkey. This is so pure. I'm obsessed with this therapy horse that looks like it has the soul of a murdered victim. Victorian.
an error child. I heard a light knock on my door and went to answer it and it was my landlord's dog bringing me a stick. I painted this for my husband. It was the first piece I ever finished. He never stops talking about the cat he had growing up, so this was the best I could give him. Heart shaped stoplights. This would 100% make highways a happier place. Today in art class, our teacher was absent and our substitute was one of the animators for Courage the Cowardly Dog. After mom scolded the little girl for using her face cream, this dog defended and protected the baby. This dog loves his veggies so much that he stole a cabbage from the neighbor's farm. This makes me so happy. That's a very good, clear message that is surprisingly hard to articulate. You go, dragon. You go. My friend's cat brings him mushrooms every day. No mice, no insects, only mushrooms. Ethical dilemma. Both cats are meowing for you to come play with them, but are in separate rooms and are watching you so they will know if you choose the other cat. I'm, I'm actually just bringing both of the cats into my room. Thinking about this badass from North Carolina who single-handedly saved 2100 types of apples from going into extinction. This is my cat. That is not my house. When granny knows you love science, she makes you little things like this. Not to impress. I saw guts from Berserk with huge muscles and decided to gain muscles. Don't I look cute? It's so messed up. Bears look like this and can kill you. She rated the movie 12 out of 10 and loved meeting her idol. I fell asleep on the couch and woke up with this cat on my lap. I have three cats and this isn't one of them. My favorite part of lockdown was when zoos just started introducing animals to each other like, hey look, hey, look at this lizard. Imagine waking up one morning, having a stretch and opening your bedroom curtains and there in your window plant box are three sleeping squirrels. This is the cutest nope I have ever seen. No wonder their pit stops have been the fastest this season. It's dead summer. Your mom comes home from the store with these. What do you call these? And what is the best color? Mother and son are becoming father and daughter. This dude letting his squirtle play on his phone while riding the subway is the backbone of our society. Cute old couple got on CNN because they found a duck shaped tomato in their garden. My little bro wants to be Ice Cube so bad. Seems like Ice Cube to me. Happy birthday lol homie. Taking big man for ice cream. Came home drunk last night and got way too excited to see my cat. Pet beds were on sale and I had a coupon so Guts got a new bed. It's very plush and he likes it a lot. That's a weird looking dog but he's still a cute dog. It's nice you bought a bed for your croissant. They got crocs for dogs. Dog passed out and the Roomba thought it was furniture. Found the real life ghost emoji. Saw this dog waving goodbye to everybody exiting the grocery store. There was a coyote outside. You know what that means. Coyote vest time. Not today coyotes. Some personal news. We're replacing our countertops tomorrow and I'm so excited. Mainly because we got to remove this abomination of a kitchen sink. It took Snorlax 18 years to get up so be like Snorlax and never give up. Absolutely insane that my friend's dog that looks like this has not gone viral yet. Friend goals. This is a gang. My 10 year old brother called me to tell me he had a girlfriend and then sent me this. Her scrunchie is on my wrist. Sounds pretty serious. 19 years later she's a pilot just like her dad. He doesn't even know he is a cat. My technician leaves me notes about things I should know before I enter a patient's room. I think my technician needs a raise. She is his wife not daughter. My dog goes to work with me every day and my boss got him a Christmas bonus. My uncle didn't go to school so here I am teaching him how to write. Plumber did work for a 91 year old grandma with cancer and his invoice is now going viral. This is better than the kiss cam when it lands on old couples. This cat walks into a grocery store, steals some treats and ends up taking a nap. People are so weird. What do they even want? The only thing people want. Anytime my grandparents ask Alexa to play a song, they always say thank you afterwards. My nan has dementia and every day she meets my dog for the first time and falls in love with him over and over again. Yeah, both of my grandparents have dementia. Really bad. This is really nice. My mom watching her baby hold her own baby. This is the sweetest picture I've ever seen. I get an email every time I get a package delivery to my apartment mail room. It's supposed to be a photo of the label, but there's this one guy. A man and a grey goose named Maria formed a close relationship. She would wait for him every morning at the park where they would walk together. She even chases away any other geese and any dog that gets too close to him. 10 pounds. Throw back to when my dad forgot I'm a doctor. Yes. Where are you? Hospital. Why? I study and work here. Birds then. One of the most dangerous carnivores in the post-dinosaur era. Larger than a fully grown man. Runs up to 30 miles per hour. Birds now. Scared of dogs. 
doorbells. My roommate's dog likes to sit on my lap while I'm working, and on Zoom, my boss was like, oh gosh, please introduce that cute baby. So I unmuted myself, and was like, this is Evie. But it turns out my boss was talking to one of my co-workers, who had a literal human infant. Concerned about the loss of our bees, Morgan Freeman converted his 124-acre Mississippi ranch into a bee refuge. He's hired a gardener, filled acres with clover, planted hundreds of flowering trees, and purchased 26 hives, and has turned himself into a beekeeper. We have just had our patio done, and my six-year-old has loved going out and helping the builder, so it made his day to receive this. What an example of kindness. Pay back it. Harry, for passing bricks, pointing brickwork, mixing cement, loading stone, taking pictures of blackbirds and spider, saying why more times than I have ever heard anyone say why. I'm being a smashing little guy. Minus tax and national insurance. My sister died yesterday, and can't explain how much I appreciate my English professor's compassion right now. Alyssa, I don't know what to write. I have two sisters, and anyway, take all the time you need. No documentation needed, and you don't need to promise not to take another extension. I'm giving you blank flexibility in advance. You have already done good work so far, and my goal is for you to get something positive out of the class. And after what's just happened, if you participate to the extent possible, I'll make that work. Take care of yourself. George, the dog has been depressed for two years since his best friend of 12 years, a Labrador named Blackie died. This has actually ruined my day.